Welcome back, people, to my channel, where I bring you the good, the bad, and the ugly. And you know I'm not sponsored by Energy, because they're not going to like this video. A surefire way to break your stealth is just like this. What is that noise? It's the fan. The exhaust fan to be exact. It's gonna make this loud racket for about one full minute. It's because it's cold. It's 37 degrees, but it does this noise at 60 degrees or colder around 60 degrees so only when the uh, inverter is on you're going to get that noise it goes completely away in about a minute So there we go. The noise is gone now. Now it's operating normally. And yeah, you know, my stealth was broken for about a minute. Um, this is going to happen every single time uh, when the temperature is 65 degrees approximately or below Fahrenheit. Um, I called Kodiak, told about the problem. They told me that the fan was du dusty uh, to spray some um, compressed air, you know, through here, which I tried wasn't successful uh, they told me don't open it up because the wires are very very tight um, you're gonna sever something um, you know my only other solution is to ship it back to Kodiak pay 50 bucks uh, wait a week to get there wait a week to get back and pay them an extra $30 for the labor so it's $80 and I'll be without my Kodiak for two weeks because the company is in Idaho I'm on the other side of the country so uh, there's no chance of me going by there. So I don't like that option either. I mean, there's nothing else physically wrong with the Kodiak except for that noise the fan makes for the first minute. And that only happens when it's Kodiak's cold from, you know, approximately 60, 65 degrees or below. And, um, yeah, I don't use the inverter all the time. So it's not that big of, that's not, that, not a priority, I want to say. But if you have a Kodiak and your Kodiak does this, I only had it for two years too, and it's not been in a dusty environment or nothing. It just, you know, it just happened. Uh, and and uh, I've had computer fans that lasted 20 years and then made that kind of noise. So uh, this thing only lasted two years. So hopefully they uh, maybe fix their design, um, change the hardware in the future generations of this because two years is unacceptable. I mean, if it was outside all the time, it'd be one thing, but I never keep it outside. So, I don't know how the fan got that dusty that quick, because the outside is definitely not dusty. Um, so, just want to bring you that little information about the Kodiak. Uh, I'm not always on the bandwagon for the uh, Kodiak, but um, it's a good it's a good device, though. Overall, you know, I give it, like, nine stars out of ten really um, but I'm a perfectionist they need to fix that or change the design or change the hardware if you listen energy fix it change it it's not cool two years in that's not cool all right folks I'm out lean with it